All right, we're down to one final day on this Formula E time trial competition, and I got bumped out of rank B. Um, so, of course, that cannot stand. We're gonna have to fight back to climb myself back in here. And of course, the rank C leader has higher PR than I do. Well, just about everybody has higher PR than I do since I don't have any upgrades on driver or team principal here for my uh, team Mahindra. But uh, considering my two other accounts, I was able to get him into rank B. I should be able to get the third account to go into the rank B as well. Uh, just clicking that corner, coming out of the turn four, turn five. All right, so of course, give it another go. I need to shave off some two hundredths of a second. That's the target here. And now turn one. See, hug the corner and kind of play with the throttle and here's a blind corner of course turn two and three and yet another blind corner early apex turn four and that's very important how you come out of that turn four since it's one of those longer straights where you're gonna build up quite a bit of speed so and at the tail end turn six pretty tricky corner and turn seven I can kind of play with a throttle, you don't need to brake generally. And then, there we go. We want the, well, turn nine, second to last corner, right? These are all very sharp. And then here's the final corner, and I have a pretty good lead, considering the lower PR. So, and just like that, shaving off, well, I won by 0.149 second from the the rank leader so shaving off some 0.169 seconds which of course is good enough to I would like to say pretty comfortably in rank B for 50 gold reward instead of 25 let's check that out yeah that's a I would say that's a pretty um safe placement in the top one percent with uh, just the you know final day here left on this event so all right so of course i am running without any level ups here as i said so if i can pull it off really any of you guys can pull it off as well just need to be patient and be strategic about how you take these corners right because uh, a lot of blind corners and uh, some it's not always the apex on these corners at the these formula e circuits i feel like are not always very obvious so you kind of have to experiment a little bit but um you know of course with my video hopefully you guys can compare and contrast your line your breaking point and um improve your time so there you have it good luck and we'll see you in the next video take care guys